time on Highway to Heaven, Donovan's impatience at being left in jail came to a head when he seemed to suggest that he would spill the beans on who Don was. LJ and Pastor had a heart-to-heart -heart talk, and Big Daddy Money weaves a very complicated web of lies to hide that he's in Montego Bay. And now... Esther, go put on some clothes. I need you to follow me to Montego Bay today. Why? What are we in Montego Bay for? Lord have mercy. Everything requires a question. I have to go to the bank and do some business. I can't get done here in Pigeon Bottom. Just go put on some clothes and come with me. It's not safe for me to travel alone. Anyway, it wasn't really a request. Go put on your clothes and come. Daddy, where's mommy? She leave from morning and said she was going down to see Granny G. But I know is that walkless boy she's going to look for again. She think I don't know him living down there. Well, that's your wife. She don't listen to nobody. If she had listened to us, she wouldn't be living through this embarrassment all of us have to face again. From the moment I see that man come back here, I know it would be nothing but trouble. Have you seen him? <laughs> he was in church Easter Sunday. Him really have a nerve for true. After all him doing a foreign, him have the nerve to come back here and show him face. Then him make police come to my yard and take him to jail and still have the nerve to show him face in a church. Him have a nerve for true. As long as him don't show up here again, all is well. Your mother can do whatever she like. It's clear, our baby. Gwendolyn, you put your foot in that cow foot, man. What a something sweet. Thank you, Brother Thompson. Where is LJ? Him gone up to see Pastor. Him mother come by here this morning and the two of them gone up to church. I am so glad that LG and Pastor are still best friends despite all the years and the madness that pass over the years. At least LG will always have one good person to pick him up when him fall. You done eating? It's your time to wash the plate them since you insist on always eating here. Gwendolyn, when you going to stop playing hard to get you know, it's long time I love you and begging you to marry me. <laughs> and it's long time I'm telling you, no, Brother Thompson. I'm an old woman no man. Me set in my ways. Me don't need no adoration from no man. Stop the foolishness. You are a young woman. You think 70-year-old old? Two man! In today's world, 70-year-old arm was still having baby. <laughs> <laughs> Thompson, you're crazy, you know. But I am perfectly happy on my own. I have enough crosses running this farmer from dealing with a deportee son who insists on making my life more trouble than it need to be. I don't need to add anything more to my plate. Well, you can use some help on the farm. And with Ray always disappearing for days and end, you need a man around for protection. You're that man to protect me, Brother Thompson. <laughs> my four bad dog and shotgun is all the protection I need. And my boss too shot after the boys and tried to teeth my coconut last year. <laughs> Nobody don't try nothing else again. <laughs> anyway, just promise me you're going to think about it again. The two of us getting up there in age, and it's not good for either of us to live alone. Furthermore, no other woman can cook like you, and no other man can eat like me, so I think we make a perfect pair. <laughs> well, ma, you're not done yet. Be tired. What a this miserable man. Relax yourself, Esther. I only have one more stop to make. Oh, grandma, I'm not care. Jeez, what a man fool, fool. Look at tennis at rooms. Oh, I'm coming round the like an idiot. Can't drive. Hold on. Wait. Oh, the person in that car look like Roger's son. If I didn't know better, I would think it's Roger. Is only him, sir. Which Roger? No, it can't be him. Roger in Miami. Roger who, Grandma? Your father, Roger. is the only Roger me and you know. My father? Look, the car stop. Drive up, Grandma. 
Roger! 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 I'll carry him then. Good. You not answer our look. What's that man say about him? What? Well, Brother Thompson is trying to seal the deal with Granny G, but is he looking for a wife or a cook? And was that Roger? Or is Sister Caroline's eyes deceiving her? Tune in next week for another exciting episode of Highway to Heaven. Catch up on previous episodes on YouTube.